Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a fashion video. Now I haven't done a fashion video in like a year, so it's been a very, very long time, but I thought I wanted to do this video because it's approaching summer now and there's so many new nice pieces out there that I think everyone should have in their wardrobe. Um, so I'm doing this as a like, try on slash putting you guys on. Um, I have so much new stuff that I haven't worn yet. Um, so you'll probably see a lot of fashion content coming your way. And yeah, I'm just gonna review them and tell you guys what I think of them and what advice I would give if you were buying them. So yeah, if you wanna see some new gems from Zara or like don't know how to navigate the website, which is most of us, then stay tuned. By the way guys, the foundation I'm wearing today is the Fenty Skin Tint. You can see it's so gorgeous with like other makeup as well. So yeah, I just thought I'd just add that in there. I think before I start, I'm gonna put you guys on a tip that I didn't know so many people didn't know about Zara. So before you even like try and shop, if you want to make your experience and your life much easier on the Zara website because everyone knows the website is an absolute shambles basically all you have to do to get the website to be normal <laughs> is you go to the top of the page and you'll see like a line and a circle and all you have to do guys is just drag that along a little bit and you'll see the page will just all become aligned and there won't be like scattered pictures everywhere and you can tailor it depending on how many products you want to see if you want to see lots of products at the same time you can do that if you want to see like four at a time then you can do that too so yeah I just thought I'd throw that in there because I posted this on my Instagram and so many people didn't know so yeah just a quick tip so the first item we have this long midi knit dress in a cream color from Zara this was 20 pound and I got a size S which is the smallest size and usually I am a size 6, 8 now I've gone up in size um, and this fits quite well, it's still a bit loose around my waist, my waist is quite small um, compared to my hips but it fits really nicely and the quality is good uh, but it is a bit see through like especially around I would definitely say if you don't want to have anything showing then do wear something underneath but if not it's absolutely fine um it is very light it's not like a heavy knit it's very thin um and i think they come in different colors too uh but for 20 pound i would say this is probably worth like 12 pound 20 pound is a bit much for this because usually like when they do dresses like this that come in different colors they're like 12 15 pound 20 pound is a bit much in my opinion it's not too bad it's a bit much if that makes sense um but it is really nice i can see myself wearing it in the summer spring summer time put the clothes that i've already reviewed on this side um but yeah next up we have another dress we have a like mini dress with like spaghetti straps not stretchy at all so if you are like in between sizes definitely size up but yeah it's a dress but it has like shorts underneath <laughs> i've completely put it upside down so you can see so there's these shorts underneath so i like that because it gives you that security when you're wearing dresses um you can be quite free because it is quite a short dress um so the fact that it has shorts underneath um it's really nice i really like the idea um and this was uh 25 pound 25.99 and i got a small a little bit overpriced <laughs> But it is really nice, I really do like it. It's not figure hugging, it's literally just like a flowy summer dress that I really can see myself wearing on holiday. So yeah, I think this one's really cute. Like I love the colour. It's got a pattern, but it's still quite neutral. Because uh, I don't want to have too many neutrals in my wardrobe. So this is really cute and it's got like an open back bit. You can adjust the straps. Um, I'm not very big on top. So that's really handy because <laughs> sometimes dresses they don't have adjustable straps and yeah it's not for like girls like me so yeah that's really nice as well so yeah it's really breathable really cute love it <laughs> next i've actually got two pieces from zara this is the first one it's a scarf um and it's 20 pound which for a scarf you might think is like really expensive which i initially thought was a lot but I just love the pattern. I love how it's like, you can use it so many different ways as a top, as a skirt. I use it however I feel on the day. <laughs> um, but it's really long, so you really can do whatever you want. Um, and yeah, it's just a like, really nice pattern. And I think they have a few more on there too. That's the first one. And then we've got this shirt 
from Zara as well, which is $25.99 and I got a extra small because I'm small on top, as I said. Um, but basically it's like a shirt, it's a cropped shirt with strings that basically tie around your body and you can style it however you want. But yeah, I think this is super cute, like with a pair of jeans as well, it will look really, really nice. And yeah, it's like a transitional piece as the other one is too. And yeah, I think both together look super cute, really giving me like expensive chic vibes. With shirts that are really like open cut, like this is really like open, um, it does like look good on me and it doesn't make me like look really, you know, horrible on top. I think it's really cute actually. And if you do feel a bit insecure about that, you can always get some tape and just tape the shirt down so that it's not flying around <laughs> everywhere. I might do that sometimes, but if not, just have it all out, you know. <laughs> okay, so next we've got another two pieces from Zara. It's not a two piece, but it's two individual pieces. We've got these orange shorts that I'm sure you've seen absolutely everywhere. They are so comfortable, they're so nice. They are £15, but they've got another sticker underneath. Wait, hold on. I think it's just in euros. Yeah, it's just in euros. Never mind. I got the extra small, small. So it is very stretchy like very stretchy very nice on the body it looks really nice on me and yeah i really like the feel of it. it's very very comfortable really nice it's just really nice like i really like it i wish they had other colors maybe they do maybe i didn't see it but if they do i'm definitely gonna get more of these they're really cute i really like orange orange is like my favorite color to wear as well as white and like nudes it's like if i have a color that i want to wear like a pop of color it will be orange so these are really really nice and then the second piece is this bodysuit let me just show you properly <laughs> it's like a layered bodysuit so it's got like the normal bodysuit underneath and it's got like a cropped top on top but it's like stitched together if that makes any sense um, but this one is $14.99 which I think is a good price um, I got the size small but I wish I got the medium it's not very stretchy it is but it's not as I said, like with bodysuits, usually um, around my waist is small, but my hips are really wide, so it's really uncomfortable. Around the area, really tight, gives me like a wedgie and stuff. So I think I might go swap this for a medium, which is crazy, because like I always used to be a size four, and now I'm shopping medium. Sometimes the Zara sizes are just way off. Um, but yeah, this one I have to size up um, just for like my hips, as I said. But yeah, it's really cute. It's like got an open cut in the front it's really nice with jeans again or like some leather pants i think it's really cute and yeah i really like this as well <laughs> next we have another basic i bought this midi white skirt from zara i just paired it with a top the top is from all saints it's like a padded like vest top not from zara from all saints i can link it as well for you guys um but yeah i think you can't go wrong with like a midi skirt you need at least like one in your wardrobe White is a bit risque. Um, I don't really like white skirts, I really don't, but something in me told me to get this, and they are, how much are they? £11.99, I think that's quite a good price, and they're like a good quality. A little bit see-through, but a good quality. I think just wear some nude pants, I think, and then you'll be fine. Um, but I think layering this with like a shirt or a top, like the All Saints one, looks really chic, really nice. I really like how it frames my body and stuff. Um, yeah, the sizing is good, it fits me well. Um, yeah, really nice piece, really nice basic you should have in your wardrobe. And I think I want to get a black one as well just to have. I don't really wear skirts if I'm honest, like skirts aren't my thing. I usually either wear trousers, shorts or a dress like skirts are really not my thing i absolutely love these shorts these shorts are so cute like they are so cute and i saw that this is actually a set and i didn't find the top i couldn't find like the other half of it but i'm definitely gonna buy the other half because this is so cute this is a really nice pink it's like a muted pink it's almost like coral it's not really bright but it's like subtle i really like this and it is 19.99 i got the size small um it is a bit short i won't lie like a bit of my <laughs> is a bit revealing uh you know um yeah i don't know if i want to size up or not i'm just like in between minds don't know if i want to i think i won't <laughs> don't think i'll size up um but yeah, if you don't want that risk then definitely size up 
um, because it is a bit short you can kind of see by the shape the quality is nice it's like stretchy a bit it's not too stretchy but a little bit so there's room in there as well so yeah again a very cute piece for the summer spring summer wear it with a suit jacket you know the vibes the next few pieces I'm going to show you are from Bershka now Bershka isn't Zara it's a completely different shop but I think they're quite similar I actually think they're sister brands yeah, they're definitely like related in some way. So I thought, let me just show you a few Bershka pieces as well. First Bershka piece, this dress was sold out for so long and I put my email in because I was like, I need to get this dress as soon as it's back in stock. And it's this like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's got, it's really tight. It's very, very tight. Um, but it's got sleeves attached and it's like, it's quite wide 2K, you know? This is like the piece that I was on about um, get a few pieces. This is one of the ones I chose um, But yeah, it's really nice. It's like a nice quality as well Re It just makes your body look really nice. Um, it is a bit see-through wear nude pants definitely um, But yeah, one thing that does annoy me about this is this like how they've sewn the sleeve I wish it was like two separate things, you know, like it was a dress and then it came with like a shrug like long sleeve things separately because when i'm putting this on it's such a headache because it just feels really restricting <laughs> i don't like it so that's one thing also if you are like me and don't have a lot of clean hand, um the front can sometimes slip like when i was wearing it a little bit like a little bit moved so just sellotape it i think or just like pull it up um, and you'll be fine but other than that it's gorgeous definitely definitely size up on this so i got extra small and you can see how small this is like this is literally the size of one of my legs not even joking um i'm gonna change this for a small because or even a medium i think but it is stretchy that's like, the point where i can wear it but not comfortably you know actually might be why i had an incident because it might not be my size it might be a bit too small maybe the small if you get the right size you won't have any incidents going on and then following on from that same material like a ribbed like well, i don't know what material this is but it's like a fiber it's just a nice quality material we've got this crop top and you can see um that it looks really small it is really small for a reason so it's got like the deep sides so it'll have like the whole of your side showing um but not in like an inappropriate way it's actually quite cute i really like it so yeah it's cropped and it's just like just looks boxy and nice do you know what i mean so yeah i regret not getting any other colors with this it is 14.99 i got extra small and then the final bershka piece that i got is this orange dress it's quite bright i won't lie i didn't realize how bright it was in the store because the lighting and stuff but as soon as i put it on in like the real world <laughs> i was like whoa whoa and i don't really usually like neons like this is quite neon but it's orange, my favourite. So I got it. And yeah, it's like really cute. It's got a little cutout detail in the front. It is not stretchy at all. So again, if you're in between sizes, size up. Um, you can see like, not stretchy. I got a size small, but still it is a little bit tight. Um, but I don't know whether to get a medium and risk it being loose. Or just stick to being tight. I'd rather it be tight. Like a little bit tight than too loose, do you know? So yeah, this was $27.99, which is a bit like, it's very basic in my opinion for it to be $27.99. Um, but yeah, it's cute nonetheless, like it's a nice summer dress. So yeah guys, that was a little Zara haul. I have so many other pieces, but I don't know if they're still available. I might film a lookbook for you guys with similar pieces out there if they are sold out in the stores. So yeah guys, don't worry, I'm coming for the fashion content this time because I honestly really, really like fashion, but it's never something I seem to capture. Like, I just never make content about fashion. But yeah, somewhere that I do upload a lot more fashion content is my Instagram, so check that out and follow me on there if you want to see a bit more inspo on my fashion. But yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a lovely day or rest of the week, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!